Mom? Yes? I think the aliens are coming. Um, you're just saying that because you know I love aliens. Mom, we're serious. Yeah, I can tell you're serious because of the costumes and flashlights. You do know that would mean the marshmallows. I should have known using aliens to get sugary treats, but since we are all dressed up for a Halloween extravaganza and we've been wanting to try this birthdayinabox.com recipe, it'll be perfect. Yes, and we knew that, and that's why we reminded you. I just wanted the candy. Let's get started. All right, so now we are going to focus on making our dipping sauce. In this pan, set on the burners, that's set on low. I am going to melt a half stick of butter and a fourth cup of vegetable oil. While Sophie, I melt a pound of white chocolate chips. First, the butter to sort of grease it for the chocolate chips. Sophie here has put her chocolate chips in this pan or pot so that she's ready to pour them into here when we're ready. Okay, are we ready? Let me stir up the butter a little. Alright, I'm ready, so. Okay, this thing is heavy. Careful. Oh. One or two chocolate chips isn't gonna hurt. <laughs> and now we're gonna heat this up until it's smooth and blended. Okay, the chocolate is all melted now, so the kids are gonna divide it into two pans, right, Alex? Yep. So, Alex is gonna divide it. I'm going to make this one purple, and he is going to make his green. That should be plenty for you. Okay, they're going to add just enough food coloring to get the color they want. Show them how you do that, guys. Just take the food coloring, and I'm going to start with two drops. Two drops. Careful. Alex is doing green there. One big drop. And so what color did you do? Purple? Her All right. One drop. I can make it make some play dough. Now while this chocolate cools a little bit, we are going to prep the marshmallows. And all we have to do to get the marshmallows ready is take 20 marshmallows out and stick toothpicks in them. Let's see how you do that. Well, she's doing that. I'll be spreading wax paper over this cookie sheet. Green looks dirty, so let's get dipping. Kids are going to dip these all the way into the green chocolate and then put them on the wax paper for 15 minutes. And then we're going to dip them halfway in the purple. We'll be back. All right, so now the purple dip has come to an appropriate dipping temperature. The green marshmallows, well, the marshmallows dipped in the green chocolate have been cooled. And now we're going to take these and half dip them into the purple. How do we do that? We go like, and then we will put them back in the fridge for 10 more minutes to cool. Wow! Perfect, so. I really want to eat one of these. Yeah, me too. I put a little appetizer. <laughs> you can wait. That's the caramel. Adding ice. Yay! Sophie is gonna dab each of them with three blobs of frosting because these little orphans they got three eyes. Better to see you with. <laughs> and then when she's done with that, what are you gonna do, Alex? I'm gonna take two little sprinkles, give it some sprinkles, and put them in the center of those. And it will be complete. Alright, the kids are going to get these all finished up. And now all we have to do is remove the toothpick and then... These kitty little marshmallows. Yeah, I want to eat you. See ya. 
Well, our alien treats are all done. Aren't they super cute? But we've got some more prep to do for our Halloween party. So we're going to get busy doing that, but we'll be back next week with another Halloween recipe. In the meantime, have a happy and alien-filled Halloween, everyone.